Welcome to Page Streams. This is Danny Moran. The people said to Jesus, What sign can you do that we may see and believe in you? Many of us Filipinos often ask and look for a sign from God to tell us whether what we're doing is the right thing in our work or in our family life, what important decisions we're making and we face in terms of problems like illness or financial difficulties, or what vocations, partners, or job is the right one for us. However, in many of the Gospels we read from Matthew, an evil generation seeks for a sign, but no sign will be given except the sign from the prophet Jonah. In Mark, we read, the Pharisees came and asked for a sign from heaven to test him. And Jesus said, why do you seek a sign? Truly I say to you, no sign will be given to this generation. And in Luke, others tested him by asking for a sign from heaven. And Jesus said, this is a wicked generation. It asks for a sign, but none will be given except the sign of Jonah. You see, so many of the evangelists, uh, Jesus cautions against demanding signs as a means to validate proof of coming from heaven from him. Emphasis and the importance of faith and love is really what Jesus wants, which is based on his teachings, his miracles, and his death and resurrection. He is the way, the truth, and the life. So when seeking signs or advice on key decisions we have to make in our life, I would suggest, number one, go to a good spiritual director or a credible uh, mentor or coach, someone who lives a good, moral, upright life, as well as someone who sincere and honestly loves God. However, author Father Jack Philippe has this to offer. He says, there is a real sign that you are in the right path. And this is not a physical or external sign. It's something from within, something internal. If your decision or action gives you interior peace and joy, when you feel in your heart that the Holy Spirit has given you internal peace, love, tranquility, and joy, this is the action that comes from God. And this is the sign that affirms your decision is the right one. Jesus says several times, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Real inter interior peace comes from Jesus and it's a gift that the Holy Spirit can give to each one of us. So may the Holy Spirit always bless us in our journey of our lives with his gifts, his wisdom, his knowledge, and his understanding. And may Mama Mary be our guide in our example in following the will of God in our lives. Thank you.